Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. All right, hi again, everyone. Well, I know a lot of people are anxious about the storms tonight, and really, this is the only show in town right now. We've got this severe thunderstorm warning, Washington County into the western half of Nowata County. The showers that stretch down into Creek County, not severe and weakening at this time. So severe thunderstorm warning next half hour includes Bartlesville, Dewey, and uh, Nowata and Washington counties, and it will quickly move out to the east here. So there you go, and Nowata in about uh, six minutes, Neosho in about 15 minutes. Looks like it makes it up to Rogers in around 20 minutes. Again, some quarter sized hail possible with this storm, and maybe a few wind gusts, but it's in a weakening phase right now. It was a lot stronger in western Osage County, even eastern Osage County. Back here into Tulsa, you can see some light rain still moving through. We are seeing some thunder and lightning up to the north from the Tulsa area. The light rain showers stretch back toward Bristow. And as we widen things out, numerous severe weather reports, including the latest one coming to us out of Bartlesville in Washington County with some one inch hail, so roughly quarter sized hail. Weather picks, KGRH.com, we always welcome them. How about this? Ricky Hosek sending in this picture from three miles north of Scheidler. Wow, some looks like egg sized hail there. Tracy Brown, there's the tornado that touched down near Stillwater earlier today. And then how about this one from Eric and Heather Morris? This is in the Tuska uh, Toka area. And that one, I believe, did some damage as it moved through uh, Choctaw County and the city of Hugo. Some reported uh, damage down there. Rainbow from the McAllister time lapse. A nice picture as the thunderstorms have now moved out of Pittsburgh County. All right, so here's future track tonight. Rain moves away. Tomorrow it warms up from 65. We make it all the way into the upper 80s. Maybe not 90, but 88, very doable. Few showers Thursday night, or Tuesday night, I should say. Then Wednesday, with a cold front coming through, a better chance for showers and thunderstorms and a slight risk of severe weather. Tulsa in the marginal right now, but the slight risk not far away. Grove, Venita, Claremore, Pryor, and Muskogee. Pollen counts are right back up again. We've got trees and grass uh, pollens counting on the high side. Weeds and mold are low. So our storm winds down tonight. We get back to some hotter weather tomorrow and then cooler weather moving back in toward the end of the weekend. Today's high temperature 77 degrees, record high 93 back in 1918. Right now 68 with an east southeast wind at 8 miles an hour with a dew point right around 64. So still kind of humid out there with the relative humidity sitting at 87%. Here's the seven day forecast tomorrow upper 80s. Have the yellow on for Wednesday, 84 with a 90% chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms. Cooler Thursday, north winds, winds back to the south on Friday, back to 85. Then cooler Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Rain chances are there, but the temperatures cool enough that I think it will hold down the severe threat below uh, any level to turn on any of the yellows or reds. So we'll take that good news after tonight. Yeah, a little, you know, on edge tonight, nerves no, and stuff like that. Yeah.